Mm. Babe. Mm, baby. Where are you? Oh. Beautiful. What are you doing up there? <clears throat> Princess. Baby. <laughs> Where are you going? Babe. You don't have permission to leave the bed. <laughs> Remember, I have to sign the permission slip. <laughs> Babe, seriously, don't ignore me. Princess. You appear to be getting up and out of bed <clears throat> for some crazy unknown reason. Mm, I do not like this idea at all. I just want that to be on the record here. Mm. So you've gotten up from the place where we've spent most of the day today on this cold, wintry Sunday. I'm thinking to myself, has my baby lost their mind? Entirely. I mean, come on, where else would you rather be than here with me? Mm. It's nice and warm in here. Mm -hmm. Perfect remedy for being cold outside. Babe. Baby. Baby, you appear to be getting dressed. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. This is not funny. Mm. It's like 10 p.m. on a Sunday. This is time when we go nine eyes. <laughs> Sleep time. This is not cool, pumpkin. Oh, wait. Wait. Okay, I, I get it. I, yes, you must be going to the front door, of course, and that's why you're getting all dressed. Mm. Did you order home delivery or something? This is the only reason I can think of, although you've Never really ever ordered takeout before. Mm. Especially at such a random hour. Mm, pumpkin. Mm. You don't seem to be acknowledging me. <laughs> uh, all my concerns. Mm. Babe, are you going home? Really? Why? Why don't you want to just stay here with me? <laughs> early morning, early morning. <laughs> hey. It's a very sensible comeback. Thank you very much. Checkmate, I win. <laughs> Anyways, um, you can just have like an early morning from my place. It doesn't matter where you have the early morning from. Mm, babe. I have to tell you, I... I'm really sick of falling asleep without you. I've done it enough times now. I'm well practiced at it. I did it for all those years before we met. And I, for some reason, have to 
mainly keep doing it now. Even now that I've met you. Babe, please don't go now. Really, I... I just miss you so much when you leave. I always feel so empty and... So sad when you leave. Mm. <laughs> I have this post your exiting ritual that I go through. Do you want to hear it? Okay. So when you leave me at this time on a Sunday night, I get back into the exact same position that I was in. And then I move down the two pillows that were underneath your head and I line them um, along the part of the bed where you were. And then I cuddle the pillows, pretending it's... Yeah, and I fall asleep that way. There it is. <clears throat> I know that sounds like so pathetically sad when I say it out loud, like I'm just embarrassed about myself, but this is what I do. Don't worry, I get it. I, I get lots of pathetic points on that one, but I just sleep better when you stay over here with me. That's all. And I know you say that you also sleep better when you sleep next to me. It's a little late outside, you know. It's, it's kind of icy out there. It's not really safe to be driving home. Mm, princess, mm, I'll worry about you if you leave now. Mm, stop being so stubborn. <laughs> Let's come back to bed. It's sleep time. We can go to bed right now, nice and early. And then we can get up super early for Monday. And no one will ever know. Think how lovely it would be to fall asleep together tonight. You'll feel my strong, warm body wrapped around you. Keeping you warm, keeping you safe. You'll feel my breath on the back of your neck, my breathing into your ear. If you wake up during the night, I'll be here like a rock, waiting for you to comfort you and to care for you and to defend the covers if you try and steal them from me. <laughs> But seriously, please, babe, don't make me beg. Um, I want to have some dignity here. <laughs> Just a scrap. <laughs> please, baby. I'm asking you to stay over with me tonight. What do you say? <laughs> <laughs>